leader, winner, champion, all these different words. For me, obviously, he was dad and, and to my sister, he was dad as well, but people outside of sort of close family and, and friends network saw him as, as Justin and, and people looked up to him and he didn't take the, the career or the life that he had for granted. And um, if he could share any of his sort of lessons that he's, he's sort of learned on the way um, with, with anybody. I think he was all about giving back and, and a very, as I say, un, unselfish person. He was only in Madrid the, the weekend before um, watching Tottenham in the Champions League final and, you know, um, he, he put me to, to shame in terms of fitness and, and health, you know, if we ever went for a run together or whatever it was, you know, he was always a, a fit and healthy man. He looked after himself, you know, so when I when I got the call from from a mum, it, I was like, can't can't be um, a complete shock. Um, still, don't think it's truly sunk in for me yet, um, and I don't think I'll ever accept it or ever understand why. Um, I don't know whether I, I honestly ever will sort of get to get to grips with him not being around. I'm going to try and remain positive and, and focus on the on the good times that I've I've had with him um, and the, and the memories that we've shared and there was plenty of them um, and try not to focus too much on you know the future and what he'll miss out on and obviously we, we've set up a, a foundation uh, the Justin Edinburgh Free Foundation in his name and hope to to continue his legacy you know and um, with that. That's going to be sort of the, the primary focus for, for me and the family, um, sort of educating people um, in both CPR and use of defibrillators. And um, I think that's so, so important. I can't comprehend there not being um, defibrillators in, in sort of places where people are pushing their bodies to the maximum. And it needs to be in boxing gyms, it needs to be on golf courses, cricket pavilions, wh whatever sports facility. Um, whatever your sport, you, you need to be safe and um, we, we will be campaigning to, to get a law changed and, and call that Justin's law. I'd like to think he'd be very proud. Um, he, was, he was proud of all of us. He was proud of everybody who touched his life and just hope that you know this, uh, this found foundation will, will keep his legacy going and, and he can look down on us and, and be proud and, and uh, know that we're doing all we can for him.